All right, today we're setting the ignition timing on a 305 Honda Dream. Go on and get yourself a 14 millimeter wrench, a test light, a flathead screwdriver, and a Phillips tip screwdriver. You need to have a JIS compliant Phillips tip. And if you don't know what JIS compliancy means, just stop working on your Japanese motorcycle right now. Go Google it and figure that out. Okay, there's a lot of misinformation on the internet when it comes to ignition points that you have to file them with a file. You set them with a feeler gauge or a matchbook cover or a business card. This to me says that this is a very inexact science. So I found a way to make it very exact. Okay, I've got a workflow here that you're not gonna find in the Honda manual, but it works very well for me and it's fast and it's efficient. The first thing you're gonna need to do is open up this plate and move it back to a neutral position. Once you have it there, lock it down. I like to take an emery stick and clean my points just a tad. Now, use your 14 millimeter wrench, and bring your engine up to the F mark. Put your test light on the bolt for the points and only on the bolt for the points. Stick your test light in this hole, turn the ignition off. Test light should light. Now, we want to check our timing by rolling it off and then on. You can see our light lights early. So what to do is move this F mark exactly to the line and leave it there. Loosen your flathead adjustment screws. Now move your test light until the test light just turns off. And move it back till it just turns on. Keep it right there in that adjustment. And lock the points down. Go back and check your timing again. It's coming on just a tad early. So to make a final adjustment, loosen the plate and move it over. Double check your timing. Perfect. That's it. Spike is timed in under five minutes.